Anyway, we uh, got the thing. So now we have a new location because we need to get that jewelry sorted, I just realised. The, the mould. So I think this is where we have to go for that. So let's head over there and see what the fuck we can do over here. What a lovely place! Having a good time! Look at this guy! He looks so fucking happy! He's unhappy! Is that guy here? that guy and that guy? Okay, um, I guess we'll talk to people and see what's up. Excuse me, I, I hate to interrupt your game, but could I ask you a few questions? <laughs> what game? This ain't a game, it's a slaughter. <laughs> He's right, you know. So let me die in peace, would you? Hang on, so if he's losing, does he want this? Gabriel has no reason to- Okay, well, let's talk to the bartender, maybe he can direct us to the right person. Could I ask you a few questions? Sure, I'm not too busy at the moment. Uh, bar patrons. What can you tell me about your regulars in here? See those old guys at the chess table? That's Sam and Marcus. They've played there every day for 20 years. Sam, the one with the purple jacket, he's lost every one of those games. It's not that he's a bad player. I've seen him beat guys twice as good as Marcus. But Marcus has Sam so psyched out, he loses his nerve every time. Hmm, so he does need the gambling thing. What can you tell me about voodoo? Voodoo? Don't believe in it myself. I invented a drink once called Laveau's Tomb, but it wasn't very popular. Bit of a shit name. Some people do believe, though. Even some of our regulars here at Napoleon House. That guy Sam, the chess player. See? See for more evidence he wants to fucking tell He's always talking about spells and greed <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> really? Great, thanks. Sam and VD. So what has Sam told you about voodoo? Well, about 50 years ago, Sam was too shy to talk to this pretty girl he was in love with. He went to a voodoo yen and had her make him a love charm. It was a little pouch that he had to bury under the girl's front porch. Well, he buried the pouch, and the next day he went up and talked to the girl. And sure enough, she didn't reject him. Now she's his wife, poor guy. Okay. Well, that's good. Take the video oil, Sam. You need it. You got a second, Sam? It's about your game. I don't have a game, that's my problem. Well, you're well after this painted video oil. Chess pieces while I've gone. Bastard. I never needed to cheat yet, you loser. Thought you might be interested in this gambling oil. Let me see that. Master gambling oil. What's it for? Uh. <coughs> Marcus uses that. <coughs> Jesus, I'm coughing my lungs up here. Don't you ever wonder why Marcus wins every time? Whoa, hold it. You really think Marcus... I'm sure he's cheating. Stuff? Would I make something like that up? Get out of here. Marcus would never use something like this. Well, if that's what you want to believe. This is a powerful voodoo oil. This is a powerful voodoo oil. Ah, go on. Really? Uh, could make a nun get lucky. I like that. Oil could make a nun get lucky. Really? You think it really works, huh? I'd stake my reputation as a novelist on it. Hmm. And you say Marcus uses this? That explains a lot. Let me see that bottle. You're gonna win, aren't you? It's actually gonna work. Here we go. This looks authentic. Oh, it is. If I could really beat that bastard. Stonewall, give me a pimp's cup, would you? Coming up, Sam. Go on, take some. Go on, do it. One more we'll, we'll step you onto the hard stuff. You're on pills to make you grow three penises. How much you think I ought to put in here? The whole bar. Careful, you don't want to overdo it. Too much luck can be dangerous. Ha! There's no such thing as too much. Now stand back. Yeah, could have killed somebody. Come on already, I'm ready to checkmate. We'll see about that, Mr. Smarty Big Mouth. It's the guy with the drum following me around, by the way, because he's outside, he just now it's creeping me out. Okay, guy. I see these. See you win. Do we win? Checkmate! <laughs> Checkmate, you bastard! Son of a bitch! What the years I've been waiting to say that? Checkmate! 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 You are the biggest butthead, Sam Singleton, that I have ever. Yeah, met. you butt. Checkmate! You. 
You can just put that chessboard where the sun don't shine. See, Sam's happy, and now he's gonna make the jewel for us. Yeah, fuck you. Go away. We cheated, and that's the only way of winning things properly. Nice game. Nice game. Hell, I was brilliant. Of course, I gotta give some of the credit to that oil of yours. I've been losing to that guy for 20 years. If you ever need a favor, you come to Sam, you hear? Well, it just so happens, I need this uh, jewelry made, which obviously is no easy task, I'd assume, but still. Go away, achievement. Thank you. Could you do anything with this? What is this, a clay mold? Hmm. Well, I am a Yeah, that's why I'm talking to you. And I owe you one. Would you like me to cast this for you? If you can. You got it, pal. Actually, it'll be a pleasure to get my tools out. First time in years. I've been too busy playing that goddamn game. I'll have the bracelet later today. Right now, I feel like I could do anything. Meet me here in a few hours. Perfect. What right, could go wrong? Thanks. Okay, so. We're going to head to the police station now and see if we can convince Mosley to reopen the case or something. Or, obviously, there's going to be more murders, so... I'm assuming he's not going to do much, but, you know, it's worth a little shot, isn't it? A little shot in the arm. Knight, hate to tell you this, but you're out of a book. The voodoo murders case has been closed. I had a feeling you were going to say that. Son of a bitch. Let me walk in slowly and talk to you about it before you definitely make up your mind. Okay, so... What's up? I have to tell you, bud, I'm pretty pissed off about this case being closed. You guys are making a big... Yeah, you scraps! Hey, I'm not any happier about it than you are, Knight. But I've got my orders. Reopen the case. How can I convince you to reopen the case? Look, the department's not interested. So, couldn't you make them interested? Let's kill somebody! With Great plan! I got seven bodies and still no leads. The voodoo angle's worthless, and besides, these people aren't hurting anybody but out-of-town drug dealers and hitmen. The voodoo stuff is not worthless. It's the key to the whole thing. And these people are dangerous. They need to be stopped. Okay, you want me to reopen this case? Prove what you just said. I thought I was gonna say what some shit like that. You need to prove that there's a legitimate voodoo cult in Narland. Prove that they're a threat. Get me a lead on the cult. Okay, we'll do our best, I guess. Bye. Let's get out of here. So I don't know what to do here because I, I couldn't figure out the fuck where I was meant to go or anything. So um, you meant to go here and use these binoculars here. That's Crash. What the hell is he up to with that drama? Okay. Huh. Crash and the drummer. Interesting. I can't actually recall who Crash is, but I'm sure it's relevant. Anyway, let's go and pick up our mold. It should be done now, I believe. Sam, my man. Hey there, it's you. I got that bracelet for you. Say it's a genius. This piece was a real toughie. For some reason, the metal just wasn't setting. I must be out of practice. Well, it looks good to me. Thanks, Sam. No problem. By the way, I'm heading out of town tonight. Yeah? Where to? Marcus used to tell me that if I ever beat him at chess, he'd take me around the world. The old bastard has enough money stuffed in his mattress to cover the federal deficit, and he hates spending a penny of it. I'm going to enjoy watching him squirm through every mile. Sounds like fun. Good luck. Are you kidding? Luck is my middle name. Ah, uh, Gabriel's middle name's fuck. Okay, so we have one more thing to do, which is talk to that crash guy. I think actually he's the guy that was arrested and uh, gave information on the voodoo murders, which led to the voodoo murder case being shut down. I think that's what happened. Well, he's here. And he's in a great condition. Hi, Crash. How you doing? Uh, talk to you, I guess? I need to talk to you. Ask you some questions. 
No way, man. I'm too sick. Go away. Come on. I have to know what you know about these voodoo people. Uh, you don't know nothing about nothing, Yeah, it's a guy. You are so far out of it, you wouldn't understand anything. Just like that friend of yours, Mosley. <coughs> Go away! I'm not like Mosley. I know more than you think I do. I'll believe you. Oh, forget it, man. It's not worth my breath. Or is he? <laughs> I don't really know who he is. I can't recall. Look at this. Shove this up your ass. This is important. Do you recognize this? Where did you get that? Why? Do you know something about it? Know something about it? Look at this. Crash opens his shirt and reveals a tattoo. Oh, that's bad. It's the same. The same snake. It's their sign, man. The bark of the snake. <coughs> Without it, they'll never let you get close. The sign of the snake. Right. Your tattoo. My bracelet. Now, do you believe that I know something about these people? That was a rubbish cover-up, right. Gabriel. Yeah. You know about them. I... <coughs> I guess... Just fucking tell me before you die! <coughs> He's not well, Jesus. Are you gonna talk to me or what? Talk to me, come on. Will you answer some questions for me now? <coughs> okay, I'll talk to you. A little, but make it fast. Okay, uh, God, he looks unwell, doesn't he? Uh, Voodoo? Tell me what you know about Voodoo. Look, take some advice. Stay away from this Voodoo shit. You don't really want to know, man. Believe me. Do yourself a favor and leave me alone. Uh, Voodoo Honfa? Tell me what you know about a secret Voodoo Honfa. Honfa? Oh, man. Just shut up about that. Can't you see I'm sick? Are you trying to kill me? He's not helping at all, drummer! I saw you talking to that drummer. What did you tell him? You saw me with the drummer? <laughs> Nobody's supposed to see. Oh, shit. I blew it again. Promise you won't say nothing to no one. It'll get back to him. Everything does. Promise me you won't tell anyone you saw me. Okay, but you have to tell me everything I want to know. Okay, okay. All right. I was sending a message, man. They have these rider drummers posted around the quarter. They see everything, and they report. Report? How? The drums, man. It's some kind of code. Okay, now we're gonna say this again. Tell me what you know about a secret. Video. Ah! All right, all right. Here we go. This is underground cartel in Nolans. They control everything that happens on the street. I mean, everything that's bought or sold. They have fingers in the legit world too. Banks, foreign stuff, you name it. They're supposed to be this temple. What you said, a hound for. That's their headquarters, man. I heard people say it's underground, somewhere in the quarter. I don't know where, though. Have you ever been there? No, no. I've never been in it. I'm nobody, man. So it's a, a secret voodoo drug once. cartel mafia they thing. They became animals, man. Beasts. I remember the eyes. The eyes. Oh, God, is he? Hey, are you okay? I don't think he's the okay. Eyes. The eyes. Of the snake. I think I should go get a doctor. <coughs> hey, are you all right? Oh shit! Someone, I need help. Nice to see the priest on duty. The eyes, the, the eyes of the snake. Dambala. Dambala. Crash spasms twice more, then dies as Gabriel watches. And masturbates. I mean, watches. Oh, God. Oh, poor bastard. Well, he's dead. Uh. Crash's body is slumped in the pew. What a place for a violent death. Has he got, he's got something on him. Oh, yeah, there we go. Uh. Look at him. Search him. Oh, Jesus. Well, let's get busy. Oh, uh, we can probably draw this, right? Uh, with our sketch pad of. Infinite sketches. Didn't touch his nipple, okay? His chest is a tattoo of a snake. Didn't that touch it. Looks like Hazano's bracelet. Eh, a bit, I guess. I guess I'd better copy this tattoo. That won't be incriminating at all if someone wants to find out who murdered him. Moving the body is the job of the coroner's office. Yeah, best. Not, but mind you, you didn't just take Crash his shirt off. Facial signs of strangulation. His death was not a pleasant one. 
So yeah, um, maybe we should call the police, or not just leave the body in the fucking church. But fine, we're just gonna leave. I mean, what are the consequences of leaving a body? Clearly none. Is there a way I can go to the police and report it's this or something? Late. No, of course! Decides to go home Why would I tell anyone? It's just the body! It's just the fucking body! Who the fuck cares? It's just the body! And Grace fucks off again. Hello? It's me. I can't see. Oh god, really? Oh, me neither. Let's fuck! Can I... Yes. Come. I'm sure I will. Really, it's fucking ridiculous. Yeah, I, it must. I'm gonna keep telling myself it's the voodoo spell rather than just some like random bullshit going on. Day five. Oh yeah, the road is blocked. The truth was shunned. The white flag had been waved. Reversal cost me all I had, and everything I braved. Good morning. Come on, listen to Mr. Gabriel! I wonder how he affords the pay grace, to be honest with you, you know? And that guy's still there, even though he wasn't there two sure. seconds ago. Great. Why? I'm worried about you. If I were I'm worried about the guy outside! You did. Now what's up? You got another package this morning. Overnight from Germany. Oh, guess and that Ritter guy. I was expecting that. Where is it? Well, it kind of came open, but I salvaged the contents. There was a letter from your great uncle Wolfgang and a journal. The package just came open, huh? How'd you like the journal? Someone has to look after you. You're in trouble, in case you didn't know it. Yeah, you've been reading my horoscope again. Let's go outside the great. shop as well. It's quite just a giveaway. Read the journal carefully, Gabriel. Please. Oh, it's calling. It. It's calling. St. George's books. Oh, Professor Hartridge. I'm glad you called. Did you? Oh, oh he did. was investigating the he thing did. for us, the VV oh, or whatever. Slow down. They agree. Really? You think that's them? Oh my god! Oh, within a wheel. Ogun Bad agree, huh? Well, that does sound like it. Dambala, the snake. That's the way they pattern. That's what the killed the dude in the church okay. yesterday. The seventeen ninety one slave revolt in Santa Domingo. Well, why would the Veve show up there? Uh huh. Okay, okay, okay. L look, I'll come over as soon as I can, okay? Relax, Professor. I'm excited too, but you're gonna give yourself a heart attack. Okay, thanks. See ya. Well, he's uncovered some pretty major stuff by the sounds of things. That's pretty fucking awesome. Oh, I wish you'd tell me what's going on. I swear you're gonna step into a hole you may never get out of. Don't look so worried. No one knows what I'm doing. I'm perfectly safe, and I'm getting some great stuff for the book. Besides, there's something about all this. My dreams. What about your dreams? Oh, uh, nothing. I'll be careful. I promise. What could go wrong? Did you find out anything about that pattern I gave you? Yeah, I did find something. I checked the microfiche at the public library. I found an article about a murder in 1810. The newspaper published part of a pattern found around the body. It looks damn close. You're incredible. All that work. Forget it. She secretly loves you, Gabriel, and you're dating the fucking chick that you made fall in love with you using an evil voodoo prayer. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this installment of Gabriel Knight, Sins of the Father. If you did, remember to leave that like, leave a comment, and let me know what you think so far. This is a series for you, my hardcore fans who have been watching this, so thank you so much for staying tuned. I'm still taking suggestions for the next game I'm going to play as a full Let's Play after this. I want to do more of these adventure-type games, but, like... They could be more action orientated than this one. I understand this is quite a slow paced one, so just let me know in the comments and suggestions and I'll take all on board. Bye for now. See you really fucking soon. Bye for now.